You want some piece of this post staff boy? Oh, sorry. <laughs> nice try. What? Ow. That was fucking sexy. <laughs> That's how we do it. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, you better admit it, you fucking trash pile. Stinky bitch. <laughs> get good. Or get dead. You're lucky I shoot rubber bullets. Where's the opium at, though? <laughs> Telling me these British aren't bringing a lot of opium. Ground your achievement unlocked. Nominally virtuous. Earned at least 10,000 virtue in total. and shit <laughs> some of the faces are just terrible I like the little cat there I want to think that he's wanted like he did things look at the opposite the kitty oh look at that the bell Oh, so if I come from the other way. <laughs> nice nose. Hey there, Samurai Song. Word to the wise you should hand over your valuables and move along. Or you'll face the wrath of Sagami. That's diabolical Jozo Tengu. Jozo Tengu? Never heard of them. If you don't mind, you're my way. Oi, oi. Not knowing about us is no excuse. You should put that thing down before you hurt yourself. Balls of this one. Fine. Then. You can learn our name when we send you to hell. Adorable. But you didn't realize I had guns. Class. <laughs> hey, fuck you, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Flip that, little bitch. <laughs> so we finish? Damn it. Who is this guy? I'm your worst nightmare. My name is Sengoku or something. I forgot what my new name is, actually, is it? Ryoma, that was it. <laughs> uh, now, aren't you a scrappy samurai? She's gonna touch me. Don't touch me. Hmm. Thank you. Those jerks in the Tengu mess have been causing a lot of trouble here lately. It was nice to watch them scamper. Ah. Uh, no thanks necessary. Could I bend your ear for a bit? You might be able to get men like that off the streets for good. Get them off the streets. You mean I can finally kill people? Oh, here you go. Don't steal my money. I'll fucking kill you. <laughs> all right. Dealing with them every time I pass through here would get old, after all. What's free XP? Mm. Exactly. Of course. It's not just them. Lately, all of Kyo's become a stomping ground for thugs and bandits. My father... Tachibana Genjuro 
name sounds actually really familiar, um, has started recruiting volunteers uh, to a neighborhood watch of sorts. We're called the Tachibana Gumi. My name is Matsu. Although most people call me Omatsu. Cuter that way, don't you think? Sure. Follow me to our home base. I'll fill you in on the rest. Oh, it's that door I tried to open. <laughs> the movies. Let's all go to the movies. Let's all go to the movies and try not to get shot. Boop, boop. This is Tachi, Tachibana Gumi HQ. I swear I've heard of these guys. Dude, all right, so I didn't notice this before, but look at this one. Does that not look like that weird uh, newscast we saw forever ago, the meme where it was like, he looks something like this, and it's like a little shitty drawing like this, and he has like the little eyeballs and the big almond head, and it's like the shittiest drawing you've ever seen. And then it's got like the little thing. I don't know if you remember that. That's just great. <laughs> There's some dangerous looking people in here. Let me see them a bit corrupt. But they have Kyo's best interests at heart. Tachibana Gumi uh, receives requests from people all over the city. We run off criminals, patrol the roads, and protect businesses. So you see, we need people strong enough for jobs like that. Take a look over there. Board is where he posts requests. Mm. He's post the requests we have available. We even provide sketches to help identify who you're after. <laughs> They're so shitty. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> There's a lot of people who need help in the city and plenty of evildoers to punish. I still feel like this is all a trap. If you complete any of the jobs, uh, we'll reward you as best we can. Cool. Uh. Let's see. So, Tachibana Gumi is an intermediary for people oh. in need of assistance. That's right. The more we accomplish, the safer Kyo becomes. Doesn't sound good? I'd love for you to join. Let me see. If they're getting requests from all over the city, this could be a good source Ooh. of information. All right, I'll help out. <laughs> That's wonderful. Those men in the Tengu masks are only part of the problem. Lately, it seems like troublemakers... <clears throat> troublemakers around town have been getting tougher. Some of our people even have, got, have even gotten hurt. Uh, why am I so bad at reading? Realize the tea bag got stuck there the way it did. Just poured all over my shirt. <laughs> oh, sorry. Let me wipe myself off a little sexy for you. Oh, yeah, break the pecs. <laughs> anyway, crappy this time. Yeah, apparently the tea bag was in the way, like a sandbag, and it was holding all the tea back I'm like I know there's still some in there I can see it and then as soon as I turned it, it was just like nah boom around the side 
I just rode my mustache all the way down. I hope you'll be strong enough to turn the tide. Who were those guys anyways? What did they call themselves? The Jozo Tengu. They're a gang of bandits led by someone named, well, Jozo. With all the violence going on between Shinsengumi and the radicals, they've been able to prey on folks indiscriminately. They have no principles. They're only doing it for uh, to fill their pockets. I see. Someone should put a stop to them. There are details on the board. We just posted a new request, in fact. The people of Kyo need help. And thanks to you, the Tachibane, Tachibana Gumi request board is how they can get it. To undertake a request, simply select it. New requests appear at any time, so check the board whenever you can. There are many kinds of scoundrels out there, and some may be formidable foes. Make sure you are prepared before confronting them. Remember to report back whenever you complete a request so we can reward you. Right, got it. Press the post right now. Man in Tengu mask. Men in Tengu mask are causing a disturbance at at a restaurant in Umekojiko, something like that. Eatery in Ukemojiko. Eight men in Tengu mask. Yeah, let's kick the shit out of them. Men in Tengu, Tengu mask are after. Just reread it. <laughs> so, how do I accept it? Did I do it? I don't think. I mean, maybe I did accept it. <sighs> We're getting more and more ruffians in town lately. It is really troubling. I'm counting on you, though, Saito. That's right, new Saito. I forget the word I said earlier, but that was not his name. <laughs> There's a bloody feeling out in Kyo right now. New guy, stay, stay on your guard. Thanks, Dad. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go kick the shit out of some Tengu mask losers. They're giant noses. Bugaboo. All right, let me get back in. Vroom, vroom. Am I gonna just auto shoot? Oh my God, it did. Who are you shooting at? Oh my god, you are shooting at me. Alright, let's get out of here. A holes. Must be spies. Yeah. Well, I'm just trying it out, man. You got a minute? One's higher, roster, blah, blah, blah. Dang it, I didn't mean to do that. What do you want? We're doing everything we can to take John out. I hope Hudson can hold on just a little bit longer. Uh-huh. Okay. Let's hey, go. Come here. God dang it, what do you want? One of our patrols tried warning some out of towner about Ian's gate. But the guy apparently blew him off. Said he'd survive pirates and bloodthirsty dictators. So no cult was gonna have him shaking in his boots. That's a solid person. Well, since you're stealing my truck, I'm taking your car. was hit two guys with my car <laughs> and all right I guess <laughs> Shut up. hey man that was a solid plan it just did not work out 
What are you growling about now? What? Uh, the little turkey. I got it. That's right, you bring it. Uh, uh, get wrecked. Hmm. Beat it up. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what that was. Like, why did we explode? Frag out. What? Let's see if Hellcat armor was uh, power armor or not. That I keep ending up inside of it. Thought I was just gonna shit. Skipped all of that. <laughs> Can you handle them all coming at you at once? Alright. Left with everyone here. Starting to sweat. Don't worry, each one will fight a single shot. Some of them are loaded, some of them aren't. I reckon you make the ones that are packing your first target. Most important thing. So many hits yourself. I, I blow the whistle. I want fleet feet, how do you mean? Not brute strength. All right. About avoiding fire and taking down enemies efficiently. Well said. The trial ends in 30 men down. Are you ready? I'll withdraw. Alrighty. As much as I wasn't really ready for that. How's everyone doing? All right, we're gonna do some more Baldur's Gate today. I hope you're all as excited as I am. Let's see what kind of shenanigans we can get up to. All right, let's get right into it. So weird coming back to this game after all these years in a way. <laughs> Like just hearing the sound of that uh, uh, all over again, just like man, wasn't that the sound from the last game? Because I keep treating like the uh, early access premium trinkets and doodads. Um, Have you ever known me to like a prequel? <laughs> There's always a first time. All right, so I just talked to Matt. Premise is clear, Mom. Good. We'll leave soon, and we don't want any surprises. Yes, Mom. You should speak up. Thought you'd be ten yards tall the way Zevlor spoke of you. Ceres, Scout. Seems we missed one another at the Grove, but the others told me how you helped us. A pity. You pulled them from one death trap only for me to land them in this one. Pretty mm. ambushed by the cult. Sounded brutal. Don't tell me he's missing as well. Uh, the inn is old, but Death Trap is a bit much. Uh, you managed to miss all that trouble at the Grove. Convenient. Alright. Is, uh, is Evelov missing? Aye. And more than half the others with him. We were ambushed out in the cursed lands. Cultists of this absolute. Zevlor froze. Begged us to surrender. But... They were toying with us, making examples, and we'd had enough of taking it. Those of us who cut free just <laughs> kept running till we found this place. The others, so... maybe the cult got them. 
Maybe the curse. You didn't stand your ground. You deserved your allies. It's crazy. <sighs> what are you doing out here to begin with? You're bound for Baldur's Gate. I have hope. You survived. I'm sure the others did too. You did right. You don't want to be prisoner by the Absolute. Zevlor had hope. It didn't save him. A little sense will serve us better, I think. But... Thanks. It was sweet of you to try. Thanks. Right. Don't be shy! Have a gander at the yes. finest stock! <gasps> Wait, do I have my animal speaking on? Animal to talk to. Hiss. I say hiss. hiss. Let's get your whiskey. This is my territory, us. and you're in it. My tensions are pure, and I only want to admire you up close. Mmm. I'll allow it. <laughs> specimen you are. How did you come to this place? Eh, we'll start with this one. I slinked, of course. Uh, you seem like someone who knows what he's about. Heard anything interesting? Good of you to notice. For my part, I have noticed the cleric is a liar. She promised me a bit of milk. But do you see any milk, do you? Nor do I. Disgraceful. Aww. You've had enough. Now go. Quickly. Yes. <laughs> Aww, you're a freaking cutie patootie. So now what? We just... Wait. Ah! You found your way. Good. I saw you were at my camp until yesterday. Until I was already here. So I did a few hiccups on the way. Told you I'd rescue Wolverine and others. This is my first stop. Hadn't expected to find this place trying to get to the tower. I haven't forgotten. And as it happens, I was making something to help you on your way. That is, if you're still going to help Wolbrin and the others. Yeah, of course. In that case, you'll be very pleased to learn what I have in store for you. A new type of smoke powder. All the bang and boom of the original, but with an extra surprise. I call it the brilliant retort. You'll need <laughs> it if you're going to survive this cursed place. You'll need it if you're going to get into Moonrise Towers and help the deep gnomes taken prisoner there, you'll need it. If you're going to save Wolbrin. All right. Wolbrin who? Thought that was your mission. Let's call a thing a thing. A deep gnome won't get far into the Absolute's orgy of evil. <laughs> we already learned that in the Underdark with those sadistic Dwergar, didn't we? It's doubly true in this place. You, on the other hand, have proven resourceful in such infiltrations. I'll do my part according to my talents. And you, I hope, will do yours. The brilliant retort will aid you. Thus, I will make it. Sorry, my shorts are like in a twist. <laughs> when I sat down, they hiked up real hard. There we go. Alright, I'll make it. Right. I like the name. What's it do? Let's not ruin the surprise. Hmm? You. You do whatever it is you do. Some of us are counting on you. 
Ready? What now? Is the retort ready? No! And pestering the craftsman won't speed things up. Okay, okay. No, I'm sure you trade. would. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest stock. Arrow of Dragon Slaying. You know, never say never. You are considered a construct. Your weapon attack rolls have advantage, and you have resistance Premium trinkets to light and doodars. That could be kind of good. You're done rifling through my things. Don't be shy. Oh yeah, okay, so since she's not unarmored. It literally does nothing for Don't her. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest stock. Yeah, she said a 15 without. Yeah, her not armored defense kind of sucks, to be honest. It's surprising. Premium trinkets and doodars. So yeah, she can't wear heavy. And all right. Let's give her the automatons. Hey, take a moment, Brad. Ah, you found your way. Good. The hell. Forward. Perimeter's clear, ma'am. Good. We'll leave soon. We don't want any support. I guess. I haven't forgotten. That is, if you're still going to help. If I knew you'll need, you'll you'll need it. If you're going to save Wilbrin. They didn't get trapped. They were kidnapped. Come on. Taken against their will by those cultists. If I ever get my hands on one of them. Well, with you on the job, perhaps I won't have to find out. The brilliant retort will aid you. Okay, yeah, Thus, so. I will make it. Unless you've got access to a 300-year-old Tempusian apothecarial almanac? No. But that's for me to worry. You... you... Okay, some of us are... But I will, damn it. What now? Maybe. I'm sure you would. Okay. <sighs> Automatons. Last light's best bargains right here. among the cultists, ma'am. Preparing to march, I wager. Seems that way.
All these people having all these cool dyes. Premium trinkets and doodads. You're done rifling through my. Okay. I'd love to. Thanks. I don't have to activate them or anything, do I? Oh, I do. So for ten turns, I get advantage on all attack rolls. I could do that then rage. Last light's best bargains right here. <laughs> yes, yes, I'm well aware. Shy? Have a gander at the finest stock. All right. Believe this. Your job is to serve drinks. Best be on my way. So now what? We just wait. Stop we just shouting. Yes. I'm not wait. shouting. I won't We're cool. Hey, you. What's up with this guy? Roland, be nice to my boys. There's another bottle of Arabellan Dry back there. Put it on the bar. Then piss off and leave me alone. Jahira said we should serve drinks, but that we shouldn't serve drunks. Jahira didn't save your ragged little tail from the cultists. I did. Hey, Rowan. You're treating the kids nice. Want to talk about stars instead of drowning them? Actually, yeah, it's more of my style. <laughs> I'd rather drown than talk to a sanctimonious prick like you. If you're here to save the day again, you're a little late this time. Heard about the attack. I'm here to help. Oh, sod off! I'm only here because you helped me and my family. I was ready to cut and run back at the grove, but you had other ideas. Carl and Leo are taken in by your crap. You convinced them to play hero, and now they're gone. They're not dead, so... And it's my responsibility to bring them back. They're my responsibility. You go save the world. Or your own ass. Or whatever it is you do. I'll fix this. Aw, oh, buddy. You're gonna die trying, aren't you? I tried oh, telling Mr. Roland that he'd had enough too. He didn't like it then either. This is about Roland. Go away. I'm sorry. He acts like he wished we weren't here. Like he wished he hadn't saved us. But he did save you, and that's what matters. And now we're just trying to save him from drinking himself stupid. I get it. You're trying to look after him. Yeah. He did save us after all. Anyway, it's his loss. What do you mean, his loss? I found this book. Old, dusty, full of strange lettering. Pretty sure it's magic. I was going to give it to Roland so he could learn new spells, you know? Beats drinking till he forgets the ones he knows. It's great gift. I'm sure he'll love it. Maybe. Thanks for talking and stuff. Mm. 
I don't need your help, and I don't need your pity. Where are you Dead for all I know. Or in the cult's tower with the others who were taken. They're better off dead than in the cult's hands. If they're alive, I'll rescue them. They're my responsibility. You go save... Okay, so exactly what he said before. I don't need your help, and I don't need your pity. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest stuff. It's our girl. Oh, you're all right. Thank goodness. I was worried they'd got you too. I heard what happened. That people were taken to Moonrise. How about you? How are you holding up? Honestly, terribly. I still can't believe it. The cultists, the screams, Roland of all people, saved us. He said he stayed in the grove because of you. I'm damn glad of it. Without him, well, none of us would be here. No one isn't happy with me. Can you blame him? His brother and sister are gone. He's dealing with it as best he can. We all are. How do you do it? How do you keep going? If I keep going. A strong weapon arm and a bit of luck, that's all you need. I don't complain constantly, it's very annoying. <laughs> Danger is my life, I wouldn't change it for the world. I'll let you know when I figure it out. Just take it one step at a time. You make it sound so easy. But I'll try. You've done so much for us already. But I have to ask. The others might still be out there. If they're not dead, they're in Moonrise. And gods have mercy on anyone in that hell's pit. Don't worry, I'll find them. Thank you. If anyone can manage it, you can. Just be careful up there, all right? I can't handle anyone else dying. What I won't do is send any more of our people into the past. Last light's best bargains right here. Watch your back out there. Oh, yeah, I heard if it's... Let's see what this does. Good to see you're still breathing. It's the best we can hope for. Snowburst ring. When the wearer deals cold damage, they also create a circle of ice around the target. Man, that would have been good like two levels ago. script it's is antiquated but its pages look like they've been barely aged how much longer must i anguish here i hope to be in baldur's gate 
a 10 day ago. But the blast, that blasted toll house keeper won't accept my papers. When father hears about this, he'll be furious. There's something odd about this village. People skulk around like they have something to hide. The shrines and the moon maidens seem ill tended and barren. I'd hoped to learn about the Cethric Thorm and the village leader, village's leader, but talk to him seems to put people on edge. I'm not sure I can bear another hour in this loathsome place. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble reading this crap. Just clean my glasses, but whatever. I meant to look at what this looks like. It's not bad. Like, I like those pants. Like, if I could get just pants, I would love that. Oh yeah, I forgot to sell all this. Sell it to you. Oh hey, it's Raphael. <laughs> what now? Don't know how I'm I didn't sure see you before. Won't. things through my things. I don't see where those masks are. Oh, wait, there they are. One. Kalim Shan rules, dear. The first piece touched is the first piece moved. That's garbage! No matter where the night goes, I'm gonna lose it! Then make the sacrifice useful. Guard your mistra, or come for my Cyric. What's going on here? Look who made it! For once, I saved your butt out there, didn't I? We're square now, Chief. Say, do you play lance ball by any chance? It's my first time playing. The keen gleam in Maul's eyes reveals the lie. She knows the game well, and she wants to win. All right, let's see. For your life story, I asked if you could play. What's the next move? Win by taking the king, attack at all costs, big for his land strategy. No. Yeah. 
one. <laughs> He knows what I did. <laughs> How's that for Callum Sham rolls? Brava. Lovely work. I see I was right to make you the offer I did. You will consider it, won't you? What a lovely specimen she is. A blushing apple begging to be plucked. Please let me smack this creep. She cheated, of course, but that's half her charm. <laughs> What's the other? My favorite kind, ambition. But don't you worry about Moll. It goes without saying, she still has the unconditional freedom to choose the only option she has left. Now, let's talk about you. I sense there's something you want to ask me. I do. I have a... proposal for you. A proposal? <laughs> If you're hoping to taste my blood, little vampling, think again. It burns hotter than wyvern whiskey. This is serious business. Devil. My old... well... A long time ago, someone carved some runes into my back. I'd rather like to know what they say. Hmm... Yeah, I haven't seen those scars either. You haven't told them. And you've kept your clothes on this whole time. How unlike you. Why not let them see? Don't be shy. <sighs> God damn it. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm motivated to help you. Scars often tell such wonderful stories. I think yours might be truly exquisite. I'll see you soon. Well, now you know. Aww. Must have been excruciating. Cazador worked on it from dusk until dawn. All with an ancient blade he called his needle. <laughs> Cutting and tearing. Starting over if I screamed or winced too much. It was a rough night. What's done is done. So how about we stop talking about it and just get on with things? Although I should probably get dressed first. <laughs> it is honestly really weird to see so you with scars because you're a vampire. Wait. Hope the truth don't come through. Yes, mm. we wait. If we're called, we join the fight against Ketherick. And with the true soul, we will land the final blow. Premium trinkets and doodars. Rest while you can. Oh, yeah. Wait, what did you say? <laughs> I didn't mean to skip that. Rest while you can. Just not in the beds. Unless your tadpole wants lice for company. Yeah, I'm glad. I was looking at the bed and I was like, oh, I should lay down. And then I was like, hmm. This place is kind of grody. Oh, if I gotta run out, never mind. Take it easy while you can. We'll keep the watch. 
Yes. Surely a great blow to the cult. They've gathered an entire... I'll be honest. Didn't think we stood a chance. Not till you came along. What are you exactly? Oh, you're a wood elf. You were something else out in the shadows. Won't forget it, that's for damn sure. What's hiding here? Absolutely nothing. Bell's diary. Ever since I returned, there's been a f filth in me. I feel in my lungs. I, I cannot get it out. It will never out. It will never out. Right this death that reeks within me. There are some things Take even the Moon well. Maiden can't heal. There are some things I'll she would never accept in her devoted. I should never come back. doing there and then looking cursed I didn't realize I had an audience. The true soul who's going to save us all. I'm Isabel. Pleased to meet you. Oh, cool. I like your outfit. Continue. We've been waiting, hoping against hope, for someone like you. Free from the Absolute's influence, yet able to walk among cultists. It's almost too good to be true but i'd be a poor cleric indeed not to avail of a blessing when i see one let me guess jahir has sent you to beg a protection spell of her favorite cleric nope oh okay <laughs> Perfect. It'll make you immune to the lesser effects of the Shadow Curse, which will get you closer to the towers. It won't be enough to protect you against the areas of utter darkness, though, where the curse is strongest. This lantern should, though. You mean the one I took? <laughs> Anything else I should know? There is, actually. While you're busy in the towers, I'll be sure to... Wait. Do you hear that? No. Something's wrong. But I haven't even got done exploring. Who are you? <sighs> Hello, Isabel. Marcus, is that you? What's oh, happened to you? I've been blessed. You can be too. Come with me, and you can hear all about it from Ketherick himself. What are True you? soul, my instructions are clear. Take the girl to Ketherick, alive. No. 
Alright, let's probe him. I don't really use the parasite very often, so let's do it. Easy read. Fuck me. No. <laughs> I want to finish exploring. I wasn't done. I'm kind of annoyed. Oh, fuck. When did I last save? Oh, no. I don't remember when I last saved. Oh shit, okay. I guess there's an auto save here. I didn't the true soul who's going to save us all. I'm Isabel. Pleased to meet you. Hmm, it's weird that I don't have the thing. Sure. I am a cleric of Our Lady of Silver, the moon goddess Saluna. As long as I keep channeling her power, this inn stays uncursed. A defense to your offense. We've been waiting, hoping against hope. Free. It's. Okay, we're Let back to where we were. <sighs> It'll make you. It won't be enough to protect you against the areas of utter darkness, though, where the curse is strongest. This lantern should, Anything though. There is. Know. While you're busy in the tower. Marcus, yep, yep, yep. I've been blessed. You can be too. True soul. My instructions are clear. Take the okay, now girl to Ketherick alive. Oh, now twenty. <laughs> okay. A haunting face swims into your mind's eye. Its instructions vivid in your mind. Nothing is more important than bringing the girl alive. What's going on? If you have something to say, say it. I'm just trying to kidnap you. We're going to need to fight our way out of this one. Pathetic. The Absolute sees all. Your treachery will be punished. The Absolute. Oh, of course. You can't believe them, Marcus. Ketherick will never give you whatever it is you've been promised. <laughs> he already has. He yeah, got fucked up. Time to go, way. Isabel. wasn't done in here. Alright. Haven't even gotten to talk to half the people. Alright, I think I do want to load back a save. Depends on who goes missing, I guess. Oh, wait, actually, let's hit him with disarming first. Him, bro, until he's dead. Back. Come along, Isabel. Are you guys missing? You'll make excellent fertilizer.
The fact that I can hit friendlies is stupid, but when I do it against my friendlies specifically. you miss? What'd you roll? Ah, oh, 14. Uh. Who the hell's singing? Go out there. They're not undead, are they? Good swing. Alright, um... Wants her alive at any cost. What? Gander at the finest stop. What? That's it. back a save because like things are fucked all right so just before he came in and yeah everyone's about to fucking die because of light issues shadow curse straight hitting him for four damage every turn <laughs> The keen gleam in Mole's eyes reveals the lie. She knows the game well, and she wants. Didn't ask for your life story. I asked if you could play. Right, What's the next move? Boop. Damn. All right. Yep, 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 yep. What yep. a. She cheated, yep. of course, 
but my I but have a pro the my old hmm. yep, yep, yep. all right uh all right Let's you start. Watch. don't want well now you can it was a... although i trinkets and doodahs all right <laughs> I should have sent, uh, I did another right, I quick save before we even went in there. All right, we talked to everyone down here. We're somewhat working on the people, other places. Never wanted the easy path. Close to the next level. A little bit of ways. I wish I had a bag of holding. Me too, buddy. Curse to put my hands on everything. What I won't do is send any more of our people into the curse. Any more of our people the curse. Boots, Trolls huh? report more activity among the cultists, Mum. Preparing to march, I Seems that way. Don't be shy. Have it a gander at the finest stuff. Is anyone keeping an eye on those children from Elder Realm? Maybe not, Mum. Doesn't look half bad, even covered in blood. Oh, survival instinct. What? When did I get that? Oh, my boots or something?
I don't know where I got that. That's actually a really good skill. Last light's best bargain, right here. It's been a long day, so we should do the long rest here soon. The absolute claws are dug deep. <sighs> Eric's good. magic won't hold out the darkness forever. We'll leave soon. And we don't want any surprises. Yes, Mom. Oh, hey, it's our boy. Seems like a good moment to talk. Karlak! I thought you'd be in the city by now. We were ambushed by cultists. Half of us were captured, the other half ran here. Off the anvil into the forge. We'll find them. Hopefully. Before you run off into the belly of the beast, there's something I need to tell you. Well, two things. Good news and bad news. Good news first. I only need one more piece of infernal iron to craft an insulating chamber that can make it possible for Karlik to- Touch people! Exactly. Oh my God. It's really happening. It's been so long. We've got the iron. Let's do this thing. Hang on. I think you'll want to hear the bad news too. Yeah, sure. But first, fix me. Please. Go on, give me the iron. Let's make it happen. Sounds important. Fine. Well, go on then. I don't enjoy saying this, Karlak. But there's no two ways about it. Your engine is going to blow and I can't fix it. I'm not sure anyone can. It's simply too hot to exist here in the material plane. Unless you return to Avernus. For good. This thing is going to blow. Sooner rather than later. But still, you, you can give me something that will let me touch again, right? Safely. Oh, yes, but... That's all I need to know. Do it. Please. But you heard what he said, and it's going to explode soon. I never wanted soon. to live forever. I just want to live good. All right, fine. Well, all right. This shouldn't take long. Same as last time. You'll need to install it yourself. This should do the trick. <sighs> there. That guy again with BD3. So did it yeah. work? Only one way to find out. Yes, <laughs> My love. <laughs> You're all right. No burns. Can we go to bed now? 
<laughs> Hold on, Karlak. There's something I need to tell you. What? That engine of yours. It's contained for the moment, but it's just too hot to exist here in the material plane oh, indefinitely. I know you know that, but the thing is, there's a cure. I wasn't making any headway with the mechanics, none at all. The environment here is just too cold to sustain metals like the ones inside you. You have to return to Avernus. For good. Or this thing is going to burn you up from the inside out. And sooner than you think. The minute I set foot back in Avernus, Zarya will force me back into service. I'm not doing her bidding again. I'd rather die. I get that, but don't rule it out. The world just might be better with you in it. Even in Avernus. I won't stop trying to figure out a cure, but... At this point, I think we all have to face the inevitable. What are you staring at me like that for? Am I supposed to be saying something? Oh, okay, there we go. I was like, what the fuck are you looking at me like that for? Like, you want me to tell her to go there? <laughs> Alright, thank you. Uh, we'll have to make the inevitable evitable then. First things first, Karlak, you have touchback. We gotta celebrate that. You read my mind. Thanks, Damon. Really, you've given me more than I could ever repay. It's been my pleasure. Good luck, both of you. Look after yourself, all right? Oh, well, we were about the long rest, anyways. Our made it through the shadows. All right, I'll wait to talk to you. No, incapable. Capable of what? Not for you to know. A rare breed, an authentic red-backed river rocks. I thought you'd be more discerning. You piqued my curiosity. Yeah, dirty twenty. Well, come here. I'm close. Your mind to mine. <laughs> Are you satisfied? No. Those are the least bovine thoughts I've ever seen. What are you really? No. Yes, thank you. Why do you have such horrifying thoughts? It's a talent. Right, you are. Goodbye. I'll trade you your secret for one of mine. I'm not a busybody. You ought to use me as an example, or you might get yourself in trouble. All right, fine. Good little hero. Do you like our new friend? He's new. Mm. I feel like there is something Not there, but you made it. I'd rather let him live for now. I am. Indeed, I am. Is he made it too? I remember you from the grove with the druid. I hoped to see you again, and now I have. Did you make it through the shadows? On the double. One hoof quickly following the other. Good stuff. Good stuff. Alright. This is the best day. The best day! So happy for you. Both of us, if I'm honest. So I'm so happy. happy for me, too. Now I just need to find someone to cuddle up to tonight, and I'll be the happiest woman on the Sword Coast. 
Well, what Damon said about your engine. Anyone in mind? I'm not sure. Depends who's got me in mind. Withers was giving me the old eye the other night. Then again, <laughs> maybe it was just an old eye. <laughs> Alright, what about what Damon said? Listen, I'm never going back. If you said I could die right now or live a thousand years in the hells, I choose to go out now with my freedom intact. I don't expect anyone to understand that. But well, I've been dealt it. a hand most people don't have to contemplate playing. Wouldn't be forever. Just long enough to find us. Let us find a solution. Or team. Make this decision together. I respect your decision. <sighs> Thanks, soldier. Your support means I've got one less thing to worry about. That means a lot to me. You really are the best of the best. Of the best. Yeah. Damn right. Alright, let's get a long rest in. Oh, hi. You get your second upgrade. How's it feel? Incredible. Like, I'm really alive. Like, we can finally be real. I can be close to you now, without fear, without thinking too hard. We can just be. Never been more excited for anything in my life. Uh, you earned it after all you endured. Uh... I was hoping you'd say that. Okay. Let's grab a nap. Unless someone else has something they want to say. Withers, and Will on his own little island, like the old dork he is. Apparently, he wants to talk. A blushing apple begging to be plucked. Hmm. Raphael's angling for the girl's soul. Yeah, no dip. Didn't need you to tell me that. She's a minor tip with Raphael. There's no changing it. Uh, we need to warn her away from Raphael before it's too late. Bargain's a good one. She should take it. She should make the right decision. You'll see. Mm, we should at least try. The girl's as bold as a lamb cavorting in a lion's den. But... I think she's clever enough to flee before the jaws close around her neck. One way or another, she'll see there's no winning Raphael's game, and she'll walk away. And if she doesn't? Then Raphael collects another trophy, and Mole sells her independence to the Hells. You've seen what happens when a bound soul reaches for freedom. I can't imagine what cruel penance Mole would pay if she were ever to resist that fell bastard. Okay. Got anything, Halson? Since you've been less than useful. The shadow curse is upon us. As foul as I remember it. Perhaps even worse. But with the Oak Father's blessing, we may soon see it banished from these lands. I mean, I can't even have these part of the party, so... the hell's the point? <laughs> We're in the midst of the Shadow Curse. Is there anything you can tell me about to lift it? This land is more than just soil and rock, root and leaf. It is a living being. In the form of a young fey boy. With the forest itself in his eyes. His name is Thaniel. I've met him in my meditations, but since the curse was unleashed, I have not felt his presence. He is its prisoner, I fear. And as long as he remains so, his domain will lie in darkness. But if we can find him, we can break the curse. If you learn anything of the Shadowfell, or of a boy with the forest in his eyes, 
Find me at once. What should I look for exactly? I can't be exact, unfortunately. Time and the Shadow Curse won't have been kind to any traces that would have been left behind. A living witness is unlikely, I'll admit. But perhaps there'll be an unliving be witness. Or some lingering echo of what we seek. Don't worry. If you find something, like we might need to talk you to will know it. Alright, still feeling at home with it's us? It's not easy seeing the ravages of the Shadow Curse. But your camp is a most welcome solace. You've shared your fire with me, your company. A small pocket of light against the darkness. But one I couldn't do without. Thank you. Welcome, man. Uh, you're welcome. Is there something I can do? Get, take your mind off things, perhaps? Damn, this game's horny. All right, uh, don't get too sentimental. I had a need of a guide. Yeah, but he hasn't been guiding. I can't even give him, like, an invite to the party. All right, uh, you're welcome. You're too modest by far. What fate would I have met without you? Rotting in the goblin cells? Dying against an onslaught on the grove? More good has been done since I met you than in a hundred years before. Words cannot express my gratitude. I was going to say, technically, you broke yourself out, killed child goblin children and goblin guards of, like, the four that I didn't fight yet, <laughs> then escaped to the grove yourself just because I decided to long rest. Uh, more good has been done. Uh, maybe you could show your appreciation another way. Bow, chicka, wow, wow. All right. Uh, no words needed. I understand how you feel. Yes. I think you do. Forgive me. Sometimes I forget myself, gazing on the beauty of nature's creations. You flirt with me, sir. Because it's working. <laughs> Wish my arms were as big as his. Hey, every time I see him, I just get jealous. How beautiful it must be to know you can hold a hand, caress a cheek after going so long without. We'll get Karlak fixed up, right? There's always a way. There has to be. Yeah, well. Looks like you're the only one paying attention. Unless other people care. Alright. Where's your brother? Hope you're keeping well, friend. Yeah. I don't see him. Huh. Anyways. Let's end the day. Fuck, really? Right now? We're about Three to times fuck. Over. <laughs> you talk, dude. Ain't me. Oh, I love this time of year. The dickheads start popping up wherever you look. <laughs> what do you want, Mazora? That was Drop so good. Drop the attitude and perk up your ears. You've got a new mission. Absolute's cult has gone and grabbed one of Zariel's assets. A devil. And a powerful one at that. They're locked up in the cult's fortress. Moonrise Towers. And you're getting them out. And this is our problem, how exactly? If they're so powerful, how'd they manage to get captured? Will your playmate's wasting precious time? Let's see about getting his priorities fixed. Ahem. <clears throat> Clause Z, Section 13. Should promised soul refuse obeyance or neglect duty, the pact holder shall cast the promised into a vernus as a lean mule. I'll make it simple. Will fails or refuses, and he turns to a thick blob of stink flesh and sinks to Avernus. 
Now, be a good boy and play fetch, pup. Or you'll spend an eternity sizzling in the hells. Mizora's words may be flippant, but they are tinged with desperation. She cannot afford for Will to fail this mission. This may be your best chance to negotiate Will out of his pact. All right, I'm down. Let's hit that. We'll rescue you, your asset on one condition. Oh, and what condition is that? Your mind links with Will's, drawn in by his increasing panic. What are you doing? I'll free your ass. Trust me. Shake your head. Never mind. Um. Uh, Yeah, we'll say trust Will me. relaxes, and your connection fades. Okay. Interesting. Now, why should I go letting my favorite pet off his leash? We could always let the cult infect the asset, but they'd make a loyal thrall. Um, remember all you. Remember all you can about devils and their contracts. Say you know pack breaking charm and chant a series of pseudo infernal phrases. Nah, that's stupid. Alright, um, do a history check. Alright. Damn it, me without my guidance. Ugh. Now nah, I want to make this roll. <laughs> this is one that's actually important for how I want to play the game. I'm tired of hearing Will's whining. <laughs> He's always whinging. Interesting. See that? They're now, doing their face. Why should I go letting my favorite pet off his leash? Yeah. Come on, you don't even gotta roll high. <laughs> you just gotta roll. Just gotta roll like a 15. <laughs> the fact that I can't get guidance with her sitting right there is kind of ridiculous. Interesting. Now, why should I go letting why? my favorite pet off his. Why is the game like this? It's like, I know you need a 14, but you're going to get an 8 or below. <laughs> 20 times in a row. Interesting. Now, oh, hey. why should I go letting my favorite pet off his leash? Because I said so. You recall an old incantation from a children's story. Said to void a devil's contract. Abi diabole et numquam ready. Well, let's see what happens. never seen such a fearless display of sheer idiocy. Bravo. I was hoping it was something like that. <laughs> Fine. I'll play your game. But I amend the pact once the mission's done, not before. Clause F, Section 9. Soulbinder shall bestow reward or favor only upon soul bearer's fulfillment of related obligation. Now, to Moonrise, pet. And do mind the shadows. They've been especially hungry. Alright, anyways, as fun as that was, to bed. Camp wishes to speak to me. Always makes my day better. I. Or is it an E? Is it even a letter? Why not just Damn transfer? Damn language is this? Read my mind. 
It's infernal. Uh, what the hell's you? Wait. Okay. Did you say infernal? Yes, I could read it for you. Turn around. I. I suppose it couldn't hurt. You run your eyes over the runes hacked into his flesh and recognize an all too familiar language. Infernal. It's the language of the hells. The lines describe oaths and the fires below, but the language is fragmented and strange. This is just a piece of a larger text. And? What does it say? Something about the fires below, it's just a fragment of infernal. Uh, there once was a cleric of Gone who was cursed with a very small wand. <laughs> uh, it's not a poem. It might be part of a devil's pact. It'll go with Infernal pact. pact. But not even the whole text. What was that bastard up to? If he did make a devil's pact, he's more dangerous than we thought. Did make a uh, more dangerous than you thought, perhaps. Than you thought. I never had any doubt. <laughs> but if this is part of a contract, it must be powerful or valuable or both. No wonder he wants me back. What have I run off with? <sighs> You ever see him write in Infernal before? No. I could have missed it, of course, but I doubt it. Casador was only figuratively hellish. There were never any devils hanging about the crypt. Whatever he's left carved in my flesh, it's a mystery to me. Th thank you, by the way. This is... well, it's something. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Will we? How sweet. Why are my hands always on fire? Like, what are my gloves doing? I think it's my sword. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, there's our boy. I was looking for you. You smell very delicious. But I will not pet the little body. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, someone else wishes to talk to me. Is it you, Will? Ahead. Are you being needy again? Yeah, it is. The more bullshit she pours, the more of it I'm forced to swallow. Mazora yeah. set me on fiends inside and outside the hells. She's never ordered a rescue. Gods. She makes a mockery of everything the blade stands for. Such an asshole. Uh. How are you supposed to hunt devils? Doesn't this violate your The same contract? thought crossed my mind. I'm only to hunt the infernal, the demonic, and the heartless. But nowhere was it stated that I can't help one. Either we find it, or I made a mindless blob clawing at demons on the front line of the blood war. Not gonna happen. Uh, that's what we find. So you're bound to be a lemur no matter what? Yes. <laughs> Unless Mazora actually fulfills her promise and sets me free. I always knew what my future held, and I know I chose right. <clears throat> Thank you for sticking your neck out for me. I mean it. But I'm not going to celebrate till I'm actually free. I can feel Mazora scheming, plotting, 
She won't let me go without making a fuss. Trust me on that. Yeah. I like one stock. God damn it! Why did it have to be Mizora? Why did it have to be Zariel? Yes, We're supposed all to the risk devils. our necks to get one of her assets. What if it's a runaway like me? Or something far worse? Dude, Mazor is the last thing we'll do, then he's free. I want to believe that as much yeah, as you I do. Yeah, I don't either. Almost as much as Will does. But yeah. I just know there will be more to the story. There always is. It's a bad idea to play games with a devil. You'd never win. Not ever. All right. Here we go. Okay. The voice of the absolute is strong here and getting stronger. <laughs> I don't know how much longer I can resist it. But it's good to see you're making progress. So You took an unexpected route here. You did a brave thing, saving those people in the grove. It wasn't even a choice, they needed help. Uh, it doesn't seem like the help I did. Uh, didn't seem like my help did much good. Cult is caught up with them. It's a waste of time. I regret it now. I didn't do it for them. The goblins were in the way, so I killed them. Wasn't even a choice. Not everyone would have helped. You alright? It just doesn't stop. We are being bombarded by waves of telepathic energy. Wave after wave with hardly a breath between them. I almost dare not rest. Each wave a set of orders to the infected. The order for your transformation has been given many times already. I gotcha. So, uh, is there anything I can do to help? I'm afraid this burden is one I have to carry. Alone. I just hope my powers last long enough to see this through. In any case, the Absolute knows you carry me with you now. It wants to retrieve me. Why does the Absolute want you? Um, did you steal the power to protect us from the Absolute? Perhaps I should hand you over. Still count on you. I stole it from Blackith. Her continued rule depends on it. As long as the Absolute exists, I am trapped within the prison. I can only control the power from here. We must make sure Blackith never gets her hands on the prison. Nor the Absolute. <sighs> Unfortunately, they are both dedicating more and more resources to retrieving it. The task ahead is monumental. But we're all that stands between victory for the Absolute and freedom for all. This is not just about you and I anymore. It has become far bigger than us. You must infiltrate Moonrise Towers, discover the secrets of the Absolute, and put an end to it so we can finally be free now i must rest and you must carry on 
Do not let my efforts be in vain. Wait, I thought we were supposed to... What are you thinking about? What? I thought you said we were going to cuddle tonight. <laughs> Where's my cuddle sesh? <laughs> you promised. What are you thinking about? What? I don't know, maybe I did something wrong. Here, real quick, real quick save here, because they don't have to. But I want to see what happens. Oh, wait, what? Hey, soldier. I okay, thought so. I might come visit you later. When everyone's asleep. Of course, nothing would make me happier. <laughs> should I knock them out to hurry them up? Uh, of course you can. But you should know. You may not want to cross certain lines physically. Oh, that's that's cool if it's a response. I'm not sure, Krellak. I think maybe this has gone far enough. Oh. Should I knock them out? <laughs> Please. We've waited long enough, I think. See you later. I can't wait. All right. <laughs> it's nap time. Everybody go to bed. It's bedtime. Someone still wants to speak to you. Right. That's you know, guy. I feel a connection between us. Like we're... Two souls walking the same path. You might be a little naive in the ways of the world, but I see promise in you. Ambition. You gonna turn me into a vampire? Ain't often you see a vampire tiefling. <sighs> I'm listening. I just worry that we're not considering all our options when it comes to our uninvited guests. How many people are infected with them, do you think? Hundreds? Probably hundreds, yeah. Thousands? Thousands and they're maybe. not just goblin trash. There are powerful people in the Worm's Thrall. Whoever's waiting for us at Moonrise Towers controls it all. But if we can take that control from them, imagine the power we'd wield. Yeah. It's not the kind of stuff we could do. Because if it's mind flayers, that means it's a big brain. And I imagine we can't really do its job. Until we transform into mind flayers, you mean? I mean, I assume there's some device controlling these things, so we find that. Murder some people and, um. Look, I'm not a details person, right? <laughs> yeah. but turning up and causing chaos has worked for us so far. I'm just saying, there's an opportunity here. If we can control the tadpoles, we can keep ourselves safe and liberate the world from this evil. I guess. I see what you mean. I'll consider it. Do. It's not often the universe hands you something like this. We'd be fools to squander it. Of course, this all assumes we live long enough to find this, uh, moonrise. But I'm feeling optimistic. Alright. Time to go to bed. I think the others are asleep. Hi. Ah, oh, she's adorable. Since I met you, all I wanted was to be close to you. We're sure I won't hurt you, right? Uh, believe me, 
I can handle myself and you. <laughs> well, actually, it might be better for us to sleep alone. What the fuck? No. Uh, May yeah. I test that theory? Say it loud. I'm yours, Karlak. I'm yours, Carla. My name sounds so good in your mouth. Filthy. <laughs> I'd like to take you to bed now. Oh, she turned blue. That's cool. We match. All right. Um, uh, thought you'd never ask. I like you, Carlac. But I don't think I want to sleep together. Uh, hang on. It's gone too far. I think I want to be alone after all. Hmm. I thought you'd never ask. Gods be damned. It's a good day to be alive. Oh, damn. Fire effect looks so cool. Yeah, the blue looks really good on her. There you go. Gotta be able to toss them around. <laughs> That's a good night. <laughs> I thought we'd be cuddling at the end. Like, instead, we're just back on our bedrolls like dorks. <laughs> Morning, not so sleepy head. Oh, last night I dreamt a bird was singing to me. And look, there she is. Oh, <laughs> God, sorry. I was in my own world. Uh, hi. <laughs> Hello, good morning. Sorry I didn't wait around this morning. I was just... just buzzing. Didn't want to wake you. She's adorable. Uh, did you sleep well? I loved yeah, it I loved too. It <laughs> More than I've ever loved anything. <laughs> Last night was uh, incredible. <laughs> this morning is incredible. Everything's awesome. Every moment with you is beyond belief. <laughs> Aww. You still like me, right? <laughs> yes. Now I don't. <laughs> Much more than like. I'm much more than like you too. <laughs> and, uh, and nothing bad is going to happen now. No, nothing bad is going to happen to us ever again. I think you know better than that. Uh, if our record has is anything to go by, there's plenty of disasters in our future, but we'll face them together. In that case, bring it on. I adore you, you know. Ah. I love you too. I love you too! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Aggressive! Oh my God. I've been dying to say that. <laughs> He's adorable. Oh my God. If I smile any bigger, my face is going <laughs> to crack. <laughs> oh, I'm pathetic. Besotted. And it's all your fault. <laughs> I guess we better get the day on. So much to do, so much to see. Together. I think we all hope for Carlac hey. in our life. A dork who just really likes us. <laughs> Alright, um... Is something I was going to grab in here? Alright. There's one mask. Where are the other two? Yeah, 
You know, it'd really help if you didn't open... So the asks went. I sent them back to camp. Oh, wait, there they are. Double foil mask. Double foil mask. Why is that one different? Oh, there it is. Okay. Deal with you in a second, little bugaboo. What'd you bring me today? dog wags his tail, a small bag clenched between his teeth. Sure, let me see what you got, little buddy. He gives in and surrenders his find to you. Oh, thank you. Good boy. Scratch his tongue lolls out happily. I come. If you're all right by Jahira, you're all right by me. Okay. All right. Can I have all the silver. Maybe I need the silver later on, but. I meant to give that to Carlac.
Take care now. I don't remember grabbing the poison apples, but I can go back to camp. <laughs> oh, yeah, and I meant to split this off. I don't know, I just have a feeling I'm going to get, like, my money stolen later in the game at some point. Plus, weight-wise, it's just smart. Like, once we get to the big city, that's where I'm like, I feel like things are gonna happen. Hey, good looking. Not gonna. Goodies. At least things have stayed interesting. Oh, bottles. Watching us. If you're all right by Jahira, you're all right by me. For some reason I thought they were grease. Take care now. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I still wouldn't mind making a character that literally throws gold at people to kill them. A split. Let's do 500. Shouldn't need more than that on me at a time. I'm my own pimp. Yeah, you can use that. You can use that. That's for you too. I feel like that's the easy thing. Camp. God's blood, this is heavy. It's for a good cause. Aye. Our asses. Jahira wants to know about her place. Can we make it home? Burning through our oil. I haven't talked to her yet. But she'll just about do. Just about? Just about. <clears throat> we shouldn't hang around too long, though. <clears throat> From up here, you can almost pretend Isabel's light is the sun. <laughs> See any movement up there? Too dark to tell. Wonder if the guards are watching me. I bet they're close. Watching us. I'm trying to think, how can I uh, trap where the devils are going to come from, what, you know, whatever they are. I don't really think there's a way to do it, so I guess we'll just have to prep the fight this time, now that we know it's coming. Oh wait, ooh, I completely forgot I was supposed to talk to you. Alright, I was supposed to talk to you, and I think I skipped conversation with one other person around here but Please. let's talk to her first be welcome have a drink oh my gods 
<laughs> to your very good health. Definitely not poisoning it, so if I fail it, it's fine. You perceive a faint hint of cloth grass, a herb that is said to elicit the truth. Jahira smiles at you knowingly. It doesn't spoil the taste, if that's what you're wondering. Mm. Bottoms up. Rather to be honest. Well over a century old, and yet it hasn't lost a hint of flavor. Still not quite so sure about you, though. People tend to lose more than just flavor when illithids get their hands on them. I speak from experience. There's an air about you. Something alien. Answer me true, and do not lie. The parasite is changing you. Isn't it? Not in the way that you think. Despite knowing you're under the effects of a drug, try to deny the tadpole has any influence over you. Give me powers I've never had before, it's changing me for the better. Look around you. Good men, good women. Stranded here, two feet in the grave. If we're to survive, I have no choice but to trust you. Can I? Yeah. <laughs> Good. Because I'll cross your heart myself if you break it. I have every reason to be cautious. I've traced people like you. People with parasites in their brains. All the way here from Baldur's Gate. The cult of the Absolute is spreading through the city. Quietly, quickly, and with unsettling deliberation. We tracked them to this ancient village, only to be faced with a man we killed and buried over a century ago. Who was he? General Gadric Thorm. Oh, that guy. Remember that name. He's the leader of the Absolutists. He was a Sharan once. Took to building an army of dark justiciers beneath this very village. Alongside the local druids, we made it our business to see him deposed, dead and buried. But he's returned. Not only does General Ketherick Thorn live again, it seems he is no longer mortal. He has become, in fact, invincible. We met him on the road here. Commanding an army of the Absolute, intent on destroying Baldur's Gate. I put an arrow through his eye myself. Only to watch him pluck it out like a splinter. He healed right in front of me and chased us into the shadows. Things looked hopeless. But experience has taught me that no matter how bleak things look, there's always hope. You are that hope. Okay. What do you have in mind? Protected by your artifact. You can infiltrate his forces at Moonrise Towers, posing as a true soul. Find out what it is that makes him invincible, so we can strip him of his advantage. Once Gatherick is without his shield, the sword, together we assault his tower and put a final end to this blight. Yeah, sounds good. It's not a plan, except it puts me right in the line of fire. I don't care about that. <sighs> I'll make sure of it. Without a cure for your infection, your days are number two. Yet you selflessly offer to spend them fighting alongside us. I like you. <laughs> I promise I will do everything I can to make sure you survive this. Any cure starts with understanding the disease. 
Whatever magic Gatherick's using to control these tadpoles, it must be at Moonrise. <sighs> Until then, we keep drinking wine when we meet. Alright. How do I reach him? You're not our only secret weapon. Isabel, a faithful cleric of Seluna, and a light in the darkness. So does Seluna. She cast the right? moon shield around the inn. It's the only reason we're still alive. She's upstairs in her chambers. Tell her I sent you, and she'll see you through the shadows safely. Okay, so there's that. That's our first time. Staring, inspired. Premium trinkets and doodahs. Baldur's Gate, travel to Worms Crossing. Have I found Worms Crossing yet? Is that a thing? Oh no, that's in Baldur's Gate. Okay, Don't so be we won't shy. Be able to do that Have yet. a gander at the finest stock. Rescue Wolverine, rescue the Tieflings, lift the Shadow Curse, and find Zevlor. Zevlor was captured in the absolute as well. No. Metalloy Crash Region. Find the Night Song. I even go back there. Premium trinkets and doodahs. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest stock. Trinkets and doodahs. Oh, okay, I guess. It's basically saying just play the game. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest stock. <sighs> okay, so the Duke's gonna be at uh, the tower. Search the cellar. We found a strange, powerful necromancy. Yeah, we still haven't been able to do anything with that. Uh, the Chosen of Shar. We'll deal with that in a minute. I gotta go to the bathroom, so I will be right back.
beans, javelin. Can you guys like get out of the way? All's All right. well that ends. Destroy it. No, not as bad as it could have. The fuck? You're really starting to irritate me, you know? Seriously, why the fuck can't I do things? You're literally inside of it, sir. Literally right here. <laughs> Fuck your mushrooms. <laughs> Don't let me pick it up, huh? Just spike it in the ground. Sleep. It's more like that way. <laughs> Straight broke my power fist. <laughs> Your hand just goes right through it. That's so funny. Hey, you. You don't feel dead. There you go. Now you feel dead. Hey, you think you can run from me? Cut it out. Where's the last one? The fuck? <laughs> Or east or like here. So I ain't trying to recover these bombs. Oh yeah, I'm within a hundred meters. Okay. Why does everyone need things from the same fucking place here? <laughs> How many people have quests here? Just give me all of them at once so I can knock them all out. I'm tired of coming back here. Oh, we gonna kill him, boss.
That was a drug deal going on. Huh? <laughs> oh, Mr. Ghoul, I'm sorry. You were gonna live to be like a thousand. Oh, cut me short. <laughs> no one left. All right, let's go. But yeah, I didn't even get to see what was going on. It was just like they instantly blew everything up in each other. It's kind of fucked up. <laughs> Start to take my favorite leg. <laughs> oh, who's shooting at me? Why are there more of you? Let me try just being dead. What's wrong? Oh. Broke her knee so hard her body exploded. Let's power this. people that needed dead <laughs> this year is a song I will totally buy myself without any help is this how you want to be remembered hiding in the shadow <laughs> What? Where are you? Come here. Just smash your fucking donut. Oh, bro, you look like Duke Nukem, but skinnier. Acquired. Congratulations, user. You have been promoted. Your new rank is General. Updating user access. Hey, I'm a general now. Issued. Please check in at your earliest convenience. Grab it with your pocket. I don't care right now. Stop being a wimp. There are more of you, seriously? How many times would God teach this lesson? Stop trying to kill me. Right. Usually something will break everything down in here. I have become death. Hey, I unlocked an officer uniform for the Hunkley. Probably looks like some Nazi shit, let's be honest.
Yeah, it looks kind of Nazi-ish. They just went with better colors. Now, I expect everybody to thank me for my fucking serve. I just used... No, it only let me use one. Okay. Damn it! Better kill me. I just used up pretty much all my meds. Come on! Go fisty cuffs, too. Come on! Let's go! Oh, snap, I won! Holy crap, Jones, you see that? I won! I punched it to death! What? I mean, okay. <laughs> Let's push on, I guess. GG. It was a valiant effort, sir. But you have lost the game of fisticuffs. I don't know, I just punched him to death, I guess. Come on, home turf, baby. You're gonna lose. Okay, I'm back. Don't be shy. Have a gander at the finest stock. All right, the chosen Shar, chosen of Shar. Patrols report more activity among the cultists, ma'am. Preparing to march, I wager. Seems that way. Seems someone's been skimming our supplies. Is anyone keeping an eye on those children from El Torel? Maybe not, ma'am. Premium trinkets and doodads! Search for the Grand Duke. The Pale Elf. You met Raphael at... The last in asked about Kazor left on his back. Raphael seemed interested. He said he'd think about Asarian's request and see us again soon. Okay. Last light's best bargains, right? It's not here. really much left to do, just you know, talk to people and stuff. Jahira told us about the cleric. Let's go talk to the cleric. Okay. So that's all we can do now. That's new. Go on. About our relationship. Happy with things between us? If you're happy, I'm happy. Are you happy? Deliriously. Couldn't have said it better myself. Can I kiss Always. you? Always. Aw, mid-mission kisses. Adorable. 
All right. Um, it's a good old life. I stared isn't suddenly it? standing right by. It's like, what you doing over there? Sure. What's on your mind? The absolute claws have dug deep. Its death was surely a well, great was there. The cult. They gathered an entire army. Was one lost soldier among thousands? Look how fast Az is. He's a little speedy boy. Okay. So I have you prepped with what you can prep. Let's march. Careful! Don't drop anything. That'll last ten turns, so we'll do that right before. Keep not dropping things. Premium trinkets and doodahs. All right, so fear. Easier to hit. Take a moment, Bran. Savor our victory over the Drider. Hmm. I'll celebrate when Ketherick's dead. Not before. We're still alive, Bran. That's worth a cheer at the very least. No meat and cheer. There's always a first time. Last light's best. Right Ten here. turns. Okay, so that too. And there's the rest of the spells. <laughs> so many. Oh yeah, wait. Doesn't produce flame help until long rest. Okay. So now what? We just wait. Hope the true soul comes through. Yes, we wait. If we're called, we join the fight against Ketherick. And with the true soul, we will land the final blow. What I won't concentration do, spell. Premium trinkets and doodahs. level this thing. And he's got nothing, as always. <laughs> he just is what he is. The Drider doing the Patrols report more activity among the cultists, Mum. Preparing to march, I wager. Seems that way. They gathered an entire army. Was one lost soldier among thousands? Got to press on. I wonder what the next move is. If you have an alternative in mind, please do. Put him there. Damn, it's good to be alive. What? I thought it was concentration. Ah. Oh. That was so long ago, wasn't it? Yeah, that was forever ago. Fuck. If you have an alternative in mind, please do propose it. So she wasted her only fourth level spell. God, that sucks. Here, let me see. I just want to see if this is just before I talk to anybody, or is this when I was checking the list of stuff before I went to the bathroom? Yeah, 
Damn it, I hate when stuff like that happens. Like, it doesn't say, it says concentration, but it doesn't say 10 turns. Now, if it said that next to each other, that'd be perfect. My faith will guide me. I'll celebrate. Premium trinkets and doodahs! We're still alive, Bran. That's worth a cheer at the very least. It. Have you ever known me to cheer? Unless she just lost concentration by standing there, which I don't imagine that's true. Let's move. Let me talk to you. Last light, best bar. Please. Oh, oh, okay, so yeah, you have to the wood then. Eh, fuck it. What's one more long rest, real quick? <laughs> Son of a bitch. All right. So produce flame. I gave myself precision strike. And then do spirit gardens just before. It'll be like this never happened. <laughs> I love it. Let the Duke rot in prison. Crusoe comes through. Bring it to Duda. We need a way into the palace. I find this. What I want to do is send any more of our people. Fine, pup. We'll deal with it later. It's probably the one you already found, anyways. Come on, Leia. Right here. Have an Whatever it takes. Let's get going. Here goes nothing. If you have an alternative in mind, please do What's up for it. discussion? The true soul who's all. going to save us all. I'm Isabel. Pleased to meet you. Heard of you. Protection. Uh, that gets burned fast. And you have heard of you. Protector of the end, the banisher of Myself shadows. and Our Lady are doing what we can to hold free. Okay. It's... Okay, so we heard all this. Okay. It won't be enough to protect you against Thank the areas you. of utter dark. Good luck. Leave. While you're busy in the... Marcus! Yep, yep, yep. I've been blessed. True soul, my instructions are clear. Take the girl to Ketherick, alive. Yeah, a haunting. What's going on? If you have something to say, say it. Pathetic. To kidnap you. The absolute. You can't... Time to... Wait, we didn't end up in here this time? Shit. Oh, everyone must have been in the way. 
Alright, uh, disarming strike. Okay. Saved against it. Let's go for damage. Damn it. Is that missing? Let's turn someone in. Come along, Isabel. How is he getting a turn mid my turn? What the fuck is happening? That's what I mean about this game. Sometimes it fucking pisses me off that it does shit like that. Where it's like, it's literally my turn. And he's doing actions, movements during my turn. Like, even if you roll the same, take it in order. It's not fucking cool. I guess at least feast. You'll make excellent So it still counts. Under their noses. I'm so sorry. Keep forgetting that it hurt allies. They're still in the surprise round. Uh, what kind of spell would I want her to use? Let's finish this. Oh, that's right. It just does a generic. Wish she could have more abilities. She's another one that needs more s actions or
Time to hit him a bunch. Just not dropping his weapon. All right, pure damage then. General Tenry, you are alive at any cost. Call the weak working great, as always. <laughs> As where are you? Okay, there you are. Um, that. You know what? Oh, who got knocked out? Paralyzed, damn. Good, good. Hit him. Yeah. Trying to be less poopy. There you go. Alright. So we're going to clear this out. Where's your misty step? Why do I ever expect you to hit anything? Where the fuck is she going? the doorway.
Oh, okay. I'm out of movement if I do this. What path lies before me? But from here. Broke my own concentration, I guess. Let's have some carnage. Keep guessing. Moving. Well, I thought I was throwing the whole table, but I'll take it. <laughs> So glad they're not super strong. Ah! <laughs> On the move. Luckily, she doesn't really need to attack. She just needs to show up. Have a lot on my mind, and well, in it. Take a moment, Bran. Savor our victory over the Drider. I'll celebrate when Ketherick's dead. Let's just go already! But we don't even know the way to Moonrise. Not over. Well, at least we and only lost one of the no names. Okay. Isabel, are you all right? I'm fine. <clears throat> Marcus has been with us since the start. They've been tracking us this whole time. And that was no random attack. You were the target, Isabel. They know how important you are. But they don't know about you. Yeah, Kedrick will yeah, strike again. We need you to oh. strike first. Discover the source of his invulnerability. Make him mortal so we can make him bleed. Good luck. Thank you. We're in more danger than I knew. If something happens to me, everyone in this inn is dead. Like that. Yep. Why would he want to cap you? Why does a man way? like him do anything? Power spite some kind of twisted personal morality we're able to kill him i can so understand why he'd want me now. dead without me keeping the curse at bay everyone in this inn everyone intent on killing him is dead too 
As for why he'd want to take me alive, I don't know. And I don't want to find out. Now You're that we have you, you, I hope I won't have to. Once I take his head, you'll be safe. I'm getting tired of hearing that. I never get tired of hearing that. <laughs> no mercy. For Ketherick will have none on you. Exactly. End this. Let's just go! Okay, I really need to find who's doing that. I don't even know the way to Morais. That's why we should leave now. I'm gonna guess he's. It's a dude down here somewhere. First, let me look at the mirror. Not bad. I've had better days and worse ones. Take a moment, Brad. On with you. Unless you want to come back to a gaggle of shadow cursed harpers. Could be entertaining. Don't jest. We're all closer to oblivion than you might think. And when we're gone. There'll be no one left to stop Catherick. So Go on, then. questions, though. This curse seems incredibly powerful. What can you tell about it? It belongs to the goddess Shah. According to the Harpers, it fell here when they defeated Catherick. The one who tried to have me kidnapped. I suppose they didn't defeat him quite hard enough. Yep. <laughs> How'd you come to this place? Right place, right time. When a cleric of Saluna stumbles into a Sharan shadow, She's bound to set it to rights, at any cost. Okay, uh, how... I don't know how much about you. Care to fill in the blanks? I could say the same, but perhaps we should save the trivia till we're on the other side of this thing. Promise not to die, yes. and we'll celebrate with our life stories. All right, that will be familiar with Salune or Shar, because you. Enlighten me. Moon and shadow, light and dark, divine well, sisters ever at war. And this place has become one more battlefield. Sometimes life forces us to choose sides. Luckily, sometimes the choice is obvious. Okay. Coming person, I'm guessing they're either down the here or down here. Death was surely a great blow to the cult. I won't do. Send any more of our army. Was one lost soldier among the thousand? I never did check in here, so. I don't know, guys. Check on this guy. Seal. If you have an alternative in mind. Catatonic, but singing. Art has shut down and seems completely unresponsive to whatever's happening around him. What's next? God damn it. <laughs> Flame color. That's your name, isn't it? Art color? I'm Fistula. Sir, one of our own's been taken. 
a grand duke. You might know something that could help us bring him back. We found him out in the shadows, just wandering. Nothing survives out there for long. Don't know how he made it, or where he came from. This is no physical ailment. It yeah, is a spiritual malaise. Else. The man's mind has been gripped by the shadow fell, yet it has not broken. Like a shower. Uh, note the light of the lamps, the color in the face. You're not in the shadow fell anymore. Do you hear that, sir? You're safe. Without a reminder of who he is, of what he held dear, his mind will remain lost to the darkness. Maybe there's something we missed. Let's do an investigation check. Cool. His fingertips sport calluses and toughened skin, as if from manual labor. Or playing a stringed instrument, perhaps. Ah, oh, so he's a bard. Okay. Do you know where you are? If he does, he isn't sane. That explains the singing. Did you already check for personal This effects? was in his pocket. He doesn't seem to have any reaction to it now, but he held on to it for a hundred years anyway. What's that in his pocket? Hmm. Looks official. Worn letter. Art Cullig. Flame. To obtain information about current activities in Moonrise Tower and its environs, headed by Cethric Thorn of the region's ancestral Thorn family. Horrors. Uh. What was I? Take lodging in the last light inn and begin investigation on the local house of healing. Reports indicate corruption, but no collaboration has yet been obtained. Or corroboration. Uh, note the region's thorns. Region's thorn family are long-standing devotees of Salune, but rumors indicate a Sharon enclave might be gaining momentum. Investigate and report. Signed, Grand Duke. So I can say he read it too. Ah, plate armor. Okay. Do Hera won't even notice we're gone. Oh, even no. if she did, it doesn't matter. Mold. Flame color. That's your name. We we found. This is no physical ailment. It is a spiritual malaise. The man. No, Before. not till I met R. Anyway, it seems to be all he remembers. Did you already check his personal effects? We found a letter in his pocket. I can't seem to find it now, but he doesn't seem to have any reaction to it anyway. Held on to it for a hundred years, though. Uh, I'll see what I can discover. Thank you. Yeah. What kind of musical instrument do you think he works with? This one goes to you. Wits and blades always sharp.
Alright, so... I'm gonna guess he's a bard. Can't give up now. What I won't do is send any more of our people into the curse. Real quick, before we continue, no one, this, we'll talk to the kids. no one but us. Yes, we wait. If we're called, we join. Oh, it was her that died. With the true soul, we will land for final I think I need a load in a sec. Let me save. Start real quick because it's starting to get all laggy again. I don't know if it's too much clutter or what, but it does seem like every two hours it's like useful to load. Seems to get rid of the stutters. Should be a better way, but I guess there ain't. Is it ever going to launch? I guess it crashed itself or something. Fun. But we don't even know the way to Moonrise. That's why we should leave now. Hey, little pricks. <laughs> Cut that out. Ain't no going one to would Moonrise. do the same for any of us. You know it. But how do we get into Moonrise? We can't fight those shadow things. You know what Mole would hate more than anything? Bad things happening to us. You've seen what's out there. We wouldn't stand a chance. Stay put. I'll bring Maul home. But it's our job to bring Maul back. Look at him. He's a proper adventurer. And if we got hurt, Maul would bigger. be really mad at us. Fine. But you've got to understand, Maul is family. That's why bring I'm going to save her. Please. I'm going to save everybody. I'll find a way to rescue everybody. Just in case they're in like different cells or something. But I just wanted to take that idea out of their head so they stop talking about it more than anything. Have to keep going. You're the wrong person. <laughs> no time to rest. On 
my way. Recall to join the fight against the Capitus. If you have an alternative in mind, please propose it. Really, man. I want clothes for Betty Bot times. <laughs> What's up for discussion? He still won't speak. Just keeps going with the bloody song. Nothing of use on his person. His original writ of duty, signed by Eltan himself. The fella must be one of the very first flaming fist. He must know something. Let's not give up on him yet. Oh, they weren't kidding when they said a hundred years. I don't suppose you found a way into the towers. Uh, it's the guy that Isabel caught. cleared this place and he just appeared. We think he's staying at the inn when the curse fell, which means he's been trapped inside for a century. It beggars belief he's alive at all. Hopefully he'll come round. Tell us something useful about getting through the shadows. Right now, he seems to have little more to him than a refrain from some song or other. I'm guessing he was a original fist then, like they said. Also probably an elf or something that doesn't actually need to eat. Because there's no way you just survived here on your own for that long. Like Wouldn't we all? I'm not even sure he's fully conscious, but feel free to say hello. <sighs> Maybe, Maybe a new about face will inspire bard. him. Unfortunately, I won't be here when he comes around. I'm heading to Baldur's Gate to seek reinforcements. The council sent a carrier pigeon with news that the city has been dealing with absolutist attacks. The Steel Watch is holding strong. I'll request that Lord Gortash send some of them to aid in the fight against Moonrise. The curse won't harm them. Holy shit. That's my old boss. The guy who sold me to Zariel. You know the name Gortash. A counselor yeah, with considerable mentioned. influence on Baldurian industry and politics. But he is no lord. Um. Uh, he was no more than a counselor. Lord Gortash is the man responsible for the creation of the Steel Watch. It's no wonder he earned the title. The Steel Watch are the future of warfare. Gondian wow. automatons I'm, that can be sent into say. battle without risking any lives, except those of our enemies. Lord Gortash had only completed work on the prototypes before Ravengard and I left for Elteral, but even they were formidable. With the Steel Watch at our backs, we can storm the tower, whatever Kethrick throws at us. I'm sure of it. I'll do my best, but there's Depends every the chance I'll fall to the curse of all the cult before I reach the city. Don't count on me and assume no aid is coming. Work with Jahira. That harper's mind is as sharp as her blade. Follow her guidance. Farewell. We'll meet again, God's willing. Oh, I thought we were gonna keep talking. The journey back to Baldur's Gate won't be easier, but your task here is harder still. And Time more be with about. you. Fuck, I hate when the game does that. It should really tell you, like, hey, this will end the conversation. Because I want all the information, not, like, just bits and bobs. Marcus was scum. But the rest of us are loyal to Duke Ravengard. Loyal to Baldur's Gate, I swear it. Who's Marcus? They keep mentioning this Marcus guy. I'm guessing he was the reason that... The cultists are among us and you want to chat? Let the professionals handle this. Just what we played together Waiting for the sun Never we see Shadows they get darker But our Hiding place is brighter. A 
have a lot on my mind. And, well, in it. I've known Marcus for years. To think that he would turn on us, prior, on me. So. Maybe that's what it was. You did well to defend Isabel. But he was a traitor. Oh, wait, Marcus. Sorry, I'm stupid. This guy. Marcus. Let's have a look. Harper's testimonial. A Harper's testimonial, the last stand of Catherick Thorne, chosen of Shar. The pursuant text describes a battle between Thorne's faithful and magical Harper forces. I do not know what magic the Dark Jespar Justicars summoned to our plane, but if it came from the weed, then let it be cursed for eternity. <laughs> For three days we sieged towers, for three days their dark bolts cleaved our ranks, and on that third day, as his men and women uh, at last began to fall, Catherick entered battle. Didn't really tell me anything. Alright, let's talk to you real quick, Carla. Sigur Tash is a lord now. I'd like to clap eyes on this steel watch of his. You already know the story. I was Gortash's bodyguard, loyal as they come, when he made the deal with Zariel. She got a test subject for her infernal engine. I never found out what he got. This is the kind of man who gets a title. Authority. Makes me sick. Yep. Me too. A man like that has no place in power. Yeah, we'll make him answer for his crimes. Oh, the city. Baldur's Gate. Home. I can almost taste it, you know. Not even Gortash can spoil that. <sighs> All right. Take a moment, Bran. Save our victory over the Drider. I'll celebrate when Ketherick's dead. Not before. We're still alive, Bran. That's worth a cheer at the very least. Have you ever known me to cheer? It's always the first time. What this one looks like. It's actually not bad. Yeah, you look a little bit like a prick, but you know. I think I'd rather go with this though. Pretty sure it's just a cadence type thing. Two of us safe to the end. Climbing up a tree. We see what we see and do what we please. Together, waiting for the sun forever. We see shadows, they get darker. But our hiding place is brighter.
in the greater restoration yet, so I have no idea. This might be good for Az and replace his invisibility ring that he already has. Level 2, Illusion Spell, plus this that gives you Blur. Okay. My face protects me. I'd love to, thanks. Guess not. Guess we'll just sell it. What to do? Looks like we've got to get rid of duplicates again. Fun. Looks like I could sell most of these since I don't really use them. I got another closet. Cool. What if we try giving him a potion? I don't have any weak ass ones right now, so never mind. Prevented Marcus from abducting Isabel while with the cult woman are alive. last orders to investigate the house of healing so we can start doing stuff like that and then this place could be like a safe house which is good but also let me see how this works have you been cooking up okay so it works like that instead of having stuff equipped These boots have seen everything. Duke Ravenguard is more than our leader. His family. I can't believe one of us would betray him. 
Seems like a good moment to talk. What is you? Yeah, I think that's everything we could do for, for now, so... House of Healing. I think that's like right here. At least now we can take care of that stuff. What time is it? Alright, I'm actually gonna stop a little bit early. I got stuff I gotta do, so. I know we didn't do much. We literally just went around here and did a big fight. I bet they're close. Watching us. But, uh, here. How's her Let's get on with it. Alright, she's only low. And a couple spells. Looking ahead. So yeah, we could do like one or two big fights with her and then grab a nap. If not over, then through. Now Yeah, we'll save right here. Yeah, I gotta be responsible today and actually like take care of chores and whatnot yeah. that I'm supposed to. Well, where that came from. Well, so you remember to do this. Now we'll save. Alright, that's going to be it for me today. Like I said, got stuff to do. Hope you all had a good time. Alright, let's get that dad advice. It's never too late to start a new hobby. Don't let the fact that you ain't amazing at it right away deter you. You don't need to be perfect at things right away. I know a lot of us do have that mentality where it's like, if I'm not perfect at it or able to get good at it real quick, then I'm just going to give up on it and move on to something else. But, you know, if you want to get good at something, part of that is the 10,000 hours trick where it's like, you know, do it for, you know, an hour, make yourself happy, slowly get better. I mean, every day is a new day. Even when it comes to art, like, it takes years and years of practice to get where, you know, a lot of those people are. Alright, and then for today's shenanigans, you can just throw punches, and chances are you're punching a ghost. <laughs> but yeah, so, have a wonderful evening. It's been Beard. Later.